Hi everyone, this is Elizabeth and Newman, and today I have an empties video for you. Uh, these are all of the beauty related items that I've used up in about three months, which is quite a long time. Um, I've done one other empties video and I really enjoyed uh, filming it, so I'm going to do it again. Um, let me just say two things. I have a lot of products because firstly, uh, a lot of these are like sample sizes, and so there's quite a few of them, and secondly, um, the nature of my work is such that I have to shower twice a day, and so I go through a lot of shower stuff. So let's get started. Um, I finished this up uh, just now. This is the John Frieda Sheer Blonde um, Controlled Lightning Spray. So this is how I color my hair. I don't think it's quite focusing, but you get the idea. There we go. Uh, this is how I color my hair, uh, a lighter blonde. Um, I am a natural blonde, but I like it a little bit lighter. So you spray this in, and then it's heat activated. So I use a hot blow dryer um, to dry my hair with that already on my hair, and um, it does a pretty good job. I like it better than using box dye. So this is the second or third one I've gone through, and I'm already on my next one, so I do really like this. Um, I'm just going to go in random order here. Uh, this is a hand soap from The Source, I guess, or just Source. Um, this was here when I rented my house, so it's from the previous owner, but I used that up. Uh, it was just next to the kitchen sink. Um, this is the contact lens solution that I use. Uh, this is the Walmart brand, Equate. Um, this is the hydrogen peroxide kind where you have to use the special um, little contact holder that it comes with and you have to keep your contacts in there for at least six hours um, so that the hydrogen peroxide neutralizes and you don't burn your eyeballs. So if you if used incorrectly, it's, it's uh, painful, but used correctly, it works very well. Um, this is something that I got from Target a while ago and I just finished it up. It's a nail polish drying spray, so I always keep my toenails painted during the winter, during the summer, because it makes me happy. And um, after I'm done with the top coat, I'll spray this on and it does a really good job of uh, making them dry a little faster. So I will, this should go on my shopping list because I require another one. Uh, next, I have these uh, Biore nose strips. Um, these are just fun to use. Uh, I've used up the box and I've already bought another box. Uh, I don't know how effective they are in, in long-term uh, face cleanliness, but they are just fun to use and, you know, to peel off and see the blackheads on there. So kind of gross, kind of satisfying. <clears throat> I uh, used up this mask that I bought at Walmart, uh, By Nature Avocado Oil and Rice Protein Clay Face Mask. I probably got two uses out of this. I didn't really notice any benefits. Uh, I bought it because my skin was um, a little dry, a little irritated, and I thought this would help. I didn't really notice any differences, so I won't be buying that again. Um, this is a shaving cream by EOS, uh, also purchased at Walmart. Uh, this is uh, the most moisturizing shaving cream I've ever used. Um, it comes in a pump. It feels like a really thick lotion. Um, it's not aerosolized. Um, the only thing is I won't be buying it again because it is so thick that it clogs up my razor. <laughs> um, but it has this <clears throat> nice like rubberized soft touch bottle. Uh, I do recommend this. It's just not for me though. Um, so I have a uh, travel-sized uh, contact lens solution. <laughs> what frustrates me is they make these so you can't take off the top and refill it. Um, so of course you have to go buy a new one and they're mm -hmm. relatively expensive compared to the full-size one. But there you have it. <clears throat> um, I used up this body wash uh, from Nivea. Um, I bought this at Walmart. So I live in a small town, so Walmart is the only uh, close place to buy these types of things. So my favorite store is Target, but unfortunately the nearest one is an hour away, so I get most of my stuff at Walmart. Anyway, uh, this is a body wash from Nivea. This is the most moisturizing body wash I've found at Walmart, and 
Um, because I have to shower twice a day, I've been through several. Um, the only thing that I don't like about this is you can't store it upside down because it has this curved top, but um, I've been through two of these. I really like it. I have another body wash in here from Walmart. This is from Olay. This is the Moisture Ribbons Plus. Um, this scent is Manuka Honey. It smells really nice. It smells like, um, well, honey, kind of kind of sugary, kind of sweet. Um, this one you can store upside down, which I really like, and I appreciate that. Uh, it's just not quite as moisturizing as the other one. Let's see. Um, I have a lot of these sample-sized uh, shampoo and conditioner and face things. Um, I, I can't really tell the difference with one sample, but I just wanted to share it. Um, the, I do find it kind of hilarious that they call it nourishing cleansing cream and deep treatment butter instead of just shampoo and conditioner. And I don't know how to say the brand name, so I'm not going to say it. Um, this is my purse lotion. This is like 97 cents at Walmart. This is the Gold Bond Ultimate Healing um, Lotion. So I really like these. Um, I've been through like four of them so far, so I use that up. <clears throat> this is a toner from Clinique. Uh, their clarifying lotion. This one is formulated for acneic skin. It has salicylic acid in it. I love the feel of this stuff on my skin. Uh, this is like mm, maybe the second or third bottle that I've gone through. Um, I'm going to stop using this, however, because it has a high alcohol content and um, other brands, toners um, that I like better are formulated with things like witch hazel that I like better. So I do like this, but I'm going to move on to something that I think is better. Um, another thing from Clinique, I have a few Clinique items here. Uh, this is their Even Better Skin Tone Correcting Lotion SPF 20 for combination oily to oily skin. This was my um, face lotion. Uh, I always uh, choose a face lotion that has SPF in it. This was actually really thick and not very spreadable on, on the skin. Um, which I find surprising for an oil-free lotion. So I won't be buying that again. Um, another thing from Clinique, this I just used up like yesterday, I think, or a couple days ago. This is their Moisture Surge um, uh, gel moisturizer. This I really liked, and I love the packaging. So the moisturizer, moisturizer it 